Okay, so we're going to do a quick exercise uh, getting some practice with the blob brush tool. Um, so this photo is kind of a base and we're going to paint on top of it. Um, so in our layers, we're going to be on layer two and we're going to choose the blob brush tool, which is here. And we're going to paint with white. Now, if you're using a Wacom pressure sensitive tablet, this is going to be a much more natural experience because as you press as you uh, assert pressure on the pen you're going to get a wider nip i don't have a tablet so i'm just painting and adjusting the size of the brush with my square brackets so we're going to kind of put some kind of tribal paint on this person or sort of makeup paint so i'm going to just draw and you can do whoops let me undo that you can do whatever you want in terms of your design and maybe make a bigger brush there and go a bit smaller 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 and then here I'm just clicking around here. And let's also make some marks going down here. So the beauty with the blob brush tool is as you paint, it's actually making shapes, not paths. So each one of these is a fillable shape. And if you're using the same stroke color, these shapes will all blend together into one shape. Okay, so I'm just going to do another set of things here. Okay, you can take your time and do this more professionally than me. Okay, let's do one more there and... Okay, I'm not saying this is a great job, but you get the idea. Okay, so once I've done that and I've created that design, I can play around with some opacity here. So I'm going to try an overlay blending mode. Oh, I need to select it first. Okay, that would help. So in my layers, layer two, I'm just going to press Command or Control A to select all of those shapes. And let's try a blending mode of overlay. Okay. Yeah, I like that. All right, so that's it. Uh, the Blob Brush tool is really just a very free form painting tool that creates shapes. Uh, so give this a try. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and see you next time.